finally I, again I am back on the roads and uh, now I am heading towards uh, Nasik via Vai, Pune and then Nasik uh, there is another route as well to go to Pune but uh, that route is uh, even that route is 10 km shorter than this one means like uh, if you are going from Mahabaleshwar to Pune then it's 10 km shorter but I'm avoiding it because of the that route have the patchy roads and uh, most of the roads are completely damaged means like for most of the area um, and uh, I really need to drive very slow on that roads means on that kind of roads so instead of you know uh, saving <coughs> 10 km fuel I am going from this route and it will take less time and less fuel actually driving on these roads are uh, way easier than uh, driving on the patchy roads uh, especially in the hilly areas as like Mahabaleshwar is a hill station just about this tunnel part means like tunnel and when you are crossing the carts and uh, the, this area have uh, four lane road but again uh, the G force will always be there
even on the Nasik Road, there are there are plenty of dabas. Uh, they are also serving the Malaysian food, but uh, they are really not that good as compared to the Pune Kolapur Road. It's 9:30 right now, but still I am having my dinner at this uh, Akash uh, Missile. Uh, I ordered for uh, the Missile Pow. The only reason why I am taking it uh, so early because I really don't want to sleep another night without a dinner. <laughs> but it was actually an uh, excellent choice because uh, the taste was real authentic one, and uh, their service and the taste, uh, the price. The price is always good in Maharashtra, but uh, their uh, service quality and their you know the atmosphere is really really amazing. Yeah, you can definitely stop here for your dinner, lunch, or whatever you feel like. The thing uh, that was spreading in the, in the Gujarat now it's in Maharashtra as well, wherein. Uh, all the people are calling the North Indian food as the Punjabi food. So whenever you will see a board, uh, Punjabi, which means uh, they are serving you paneer, dal, uh, roti. <laughs> First, I noticed in Gujarat that uh, people are using the word Punjabi uh, to define the North Indian food. But now in Maharashtra as well, uh, everyone is calling uh, North Indian food as a uh, Punjabi food. <laughs> No matter it's from UP, from Bihar, from anywhere else, you know, it's all Punjabi. <laughs> so it's uh, 1.30 and I reached Nasik. I'm taking a haul today here. I just booked a hotel and uh, it is almost 4 kilometers away from the main highway. That's a good thing. Hey, good morning, guys. So now I am in Nasik. That's the disadvantage of taking the navigation in the small cities. Sometimes you will feel like you should ask it from the local. <laughs> so this is Kanda Kachwadi and uh, along with the Kanda Kachwadi I am taking the Vada Pao as well uh, at Saga Streets. I never tasted Kanda Kachwadis or Kachwadis like this way. It's really tasty but it's very damn spicy. Damn spicy. <laughs> See? It's all red chilies. So I tried to get my RDBCR done. Uh, I just want to clear my doubts uh, as I'm getting small, uh, you know, uh, itching in my throat and uh, I know it's a common cold because I'm getting the uh, I'm getting the cough as well but I still want to clear my doubts as I remove the mask at uh, party for drinks and all but a um, lot of people were there and nobody was wearing the mask so there are chances that I could get one from there and uh, now I'm heading home and trying to get the RTPCR done. But in here in Nashik, uh, no one is doing uh, uh, collections at uh, at the lab. Uh, everyone is asking for the home collections, and uh, uh, one one lab was ready to accept it, but they they were saying it uh, that it will take almost three days for them to get the report done because they are going to send the samples to the Mumbai and then Mumbai team is going to give the report that was really not a good option so I avoid that now I am heading towards Indore